Destiny you will overcome No, I am not afraid Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Thank you so much for clicking in If this is your first time here, you are welcome Please don't forget to subscribe, okay? Your subscribe button is just below this video, okay? And don't also forget to turn your notification bell on Your notification bell is just beside the subscribe button This is basically so that you know each time I upload new videos Thank you so much to all my amazing subscribers You guys are the best, like, thank you so much Thank you for your constant support. Thank you for loving me the way you do. I do not take your love for granted. I'm also going to say thank you to everyone who joined our channel in 2023. Thank you. I kind of feel it's more proper to come here to say Happy New Year as this is my official video for 2024. I just want to use this medium to say thank you so much for being part of my 2023 and Happy New Year. Welcome to 2024. It's going to be a very great year. It's going to be an amazing year for all of us. May God grant each and every of our heart desires and may He fulfill everything that we have written down on our vision board. Amen. If you're seeing my face for the first time, my name is Amara Chidu. I'm a content creator currently living in Nigeria. I'm grateful for the people who joined in 2023 because, okay, if you don't know about my content before, I was currently living in Ghana and then I relocated back to Nigeria. It affected my channel. I'm going to explain why this affected my channel. This is because while living in Ghana, I was sharing my life experiences, okay? I was sharing content about Ghana, Ghanaians, different lifestyles between Nigerians and Ghana, some places that you can visit while you are in Ghana. So this kind of attracted so many people who are more interested in visiting Ghana. They just want to see where and where they can plan on visiting when they finally arrive Ghana and it also attracted Ghanaians who are not living in Ghana like Ghanaians who are abroad okay this kind um brings some memories back to them and so a lot of them subscribe to my channel and moving back to Nigeria mm -hmm. Some people unsubscribe. Why some stopped watching my content? Because I no longer talk about Ghana, okay? But that's okay. Let's assume you have this particular channel where you go to watch um, about a particular content, particular content of a country, and then all of a sudden, the content creator in that channel or the content creator on that channel moved to another country and this kind of made her to stop creating that kind of content that you love consuming what will you do in this case a lot of people will stop going to the channel why a lot of people will unsubscribe but i don't really see reason why you should unsubscribe of course subscription is free so just stay on my channel okay if you are still here with me god bless you so much i appreciate your presence my day ones i see you all and you're rolling with me and and i'm grateful like so 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 grateful you know some people will just support you despite the fact they don't know you personally i appreciate you all for that so this is my first video of the year i just want to use it to say thank you and appreciate each and every one of you for your support on my channel 2023 was that year for me believe me the challenges that i faced on this channel was lot <laughs> like if you know my channel before now and then you come back to 23 and you see what happened on my channel you'll be like like seriously what happened i have no regrets whatsoever for moving back to nigeria it's one of the best like one of the best decisions that i've made in my life and i do not regret it okay so whatever that comes with my decision i am going to take it okay a few weeks from now we are going to clock one year in nigeria and oh my god it's been an amazing experience i feel like sharing everything that everything that has happened so far with you guys for you guys to know what i've been up to in nigeria it's okay i haven't spent christmas in nigeria in the last 
past five years so i lived in ghana for five years and in that five years i never celebrated christmas in nigeria so this is the first christmas that we are celebrating in nigeria and of course the first christmas now my daughter is celebrating first time she's celebrating christmas in nigeria and it was amazing i made sure the experience was worth it honestly it was worth it considering the fact that i've lived in ghana and i've spent christmas in ghana i'm just going to say this is one of the best christmas so far you know living in ghana and celebrating christmas in ghana you know, a lot of people travel back i mean nigerians will move back to nigeria for christmas but we never did and um, due to one reason or the other so during that period you kind of find yourself staying lonely and you will just be watching uh, the happenings online how your family are celebrating people that traveled back home they'll just make videos showing you what um, the celebration is all about okay so but this year I kind of experienced it I bought to I bought like I <laughs> I had so much fun I'm not even going to lie about that so, staying back in Ghana for Christmas wasn't that fun for me probably because I'm this kind of family person okay I blossom around my family when I say my family I mean my immediate family i blossom well that is family is my core values yeah so when i'm with my family the different like the experience is different so back in ghana for christmas um ghanaians don't really see christmas as that big deal don't get me wrong they celebrate christmas they prepare for christmas but you can't compare the preparation or the celebration to nigerians right this is because ghana already have their celebration mapped on on for easter like the easter celebration is there is for ghana like their kwehu celebration whereby they move to a particular place to celebrate christmas uh, to celebrate easter so christmas is not that it for them so they always look forward to easter because that is when they enjoy their celebration i believe 2024 is going to be a better year especially for my youtube channel so please don't leave stay with me while i unleash what i have for you guys so i can proudly say thank you to Ghanaians. yes Ghanaians have done me well on my channel i'm not even joking about that i don't know if i will be able to come this far without your support you know your critics everything like it's kind of shaped me into who i am today and molded me into being the better version of myself so thank you to every Ghanaian. thank you for loving me the way you do thank you for loving this stranger that came into your country thank you for also loving me even while i left your country but i just want to make this video so to properly welcome you to 2024 god bless each and every one of you if you haven't followed me on my instagram my instagram handle will be somewhere up here it's always here of course i'm actually Duru on facebook i'm actually Duru c on tiktok okay follow me so that we can interact better okay and i know the next thing you guys are going to ask me what of your ghana baby she is fine she's doing very well she's coping very well i tell you moving back here has been um a beautiful experience like i can't even trade it for anything last thing before i go i uh, will do a q and a the first q and a for 2024 just ask me any question Maybe question about my experiences living in Nigeria, if it's better than Ghana, what is happening in my life, or maybe some personal questions. You're free to ask anyway, and I will answer in another video. So I'm going to put that up in my community post. Just be at a lot okay i'm going to post that on my community post ask me questions that you want me to answer and i will answer them in a video for you guys you know i love you so much see you guys on my next one until then i love you so so much bye you just keep me moving so motion right